Hello and welcome everyone. As you must have seen into the thumbnail, we are going to discuss about update. My name is Rohit and let's quickly start. All right, so first of all, we are going to start with the first one, which is bug bounty reporting templates. So we have been doing this thing since the launch of our first course which was bug bounty hunting version one. And it was a very good success. And a lot of people into the community, as well as students and professionals liked that course. So what we basically do is we create the bug bounty reporting templates for you so that you do not waste your time into just making the reports. You can just invest your time much more into identification of vulnerabilities and leave the reporting part to us. So we have created the reporting templates that you can utilize. And today we have updated the bug bounty reporting templates as well. Now, this resource was only available to all our users who have subscribed to our UDB courses or courses from our platform, which is learn.hactify.in. But now we have decided to make it public for everyone so that everyone gets the benefit out of this. So let's quickly see that what is bug bounty reporting templates and how you can find it. So you can simply go to hacktify.in and slash bug bounty. So once you are onto this endpoint here, you can see what bug you want to report here. You can see all the vulnerabilities or bugs that we have included into our course. It starts with authentication bypass, no rate limit, XSS, CSRF course, SSRF and so on. All right. So let's say if you want to report a vulnerability, which is for instance, let's say course. So let me just click on course cross origin resource sharing. You can see the summary is over here. The severity, the curl request in case you want to send the curl request and the access control allow origin, the access control allow credentials. Complexity is easy from remote external steps to reproduce enter the domain name example.com in the POC code below and save it as exploit.html. Click on exploit button. And if you're able to see sensitive information from the target web application, then it is vulnerable to course proof of concept attached in the video. What is the impact? What are the affected IPs here? You can put the IP address or example.com, the port number, recommendations or best practices and the references. So you can just simply click on copy and everything will get copied. Just go to your favorite editor. You can use Microsoft Word or you can use Notepad, paste it over there and you just need to change the program names or whatever you're reporting to, for example, here and everything is good to go and you can simply send the report to them. For instance, you can also change it over here for whatever the program you have identified the vulnerability into. You can just simply hit back and you will again come to the main page. Uh, for example, if you have identified any other vulnerability, let's say XSS, just click on that. And here you can see the XSS summary, the severity, payload, enter the payload here, complexity, impact, affected IPs, recommendations, references, POC, copy and back. So this becomes extremely easy for you not to put your time into report making and you can obviously use this. If you have your reporting templates already, you can always utilize that. But this is for those people who do not like to invest more time in reporting rather than more time in identification of vulnerabilities. So it becomes easy for you to just copy the template, change the name of the program and just submit it. So just leave your comments into the comment section and let me know how do you like it and if you want any changes to be done into the reporting templates we would also be happy to do that all right so moving on to our next update which is cpe credits so as we had a summit which was so-called security innovation summit so now there are the certificates which have been released by virtually testing so you can utilize the certificate. Let me just show you how does it looks like the certificate of attendance. This certifies that Rohit Gautam has successfully attended the following conference, which is SoCal Security Innovation Summit and the CPE credits which have been announced is 12. 
Now you can utilize this credits in future in case you want to take further admissions or so on. Perfect. Let's move ahead. We have also updated new videos into the, our latest course, which is bug bounty hunting version two. The new videos include SQL injection, live attacks, as well as SSRF live attacks. I saw that someone commented on the SSRF video that we should include live videos on YouTube, but due to the community restrictions on YouTube, we cannot do that or we have to restrict our activities in, in which we cannot show live POCs or live examples on YouTube. But obviously you can see that into our courses. So we have uploaded uh, the new videos of SSRF and SQL injection and keep in mind we are going to update it more and more. We have already a lot of awesome content into it and we are also uploading more content into it so that you get the exposure of more and more live attacks and vulnerabilities to master bug bounty hunting. All right, moving ahead, next internship. So we are into the discussion and planning for the next internship and uh, for that, you need to stay updated and stay tuned to our social media handles. We are going to release the dates very soon. The approximate dates or the month for the internship is going to be in January. We have a lot of things which are going on and we are also planning for the next internship, how we are going to do it, how what are the labs that we are going to create and we are planning it to be a security and pen testing internship as this internship this time was on virtualization and cloud i have been seeing the students are doing awesome work over there as well all right so moving ahead uh, next is giveaways so me and shifa we both got a lot of messages regarding the giveaways that um, a lot of students missed our first giveaway in which we did the 50 courses giveaway of our latest bug bounty hunting version 2 course so for the next giveaway, we are planning to give the Hactify premium membership for free in which you can get access to all of our courses for as many as courses that we have made till now. So there are existing six courses that we have prepared into our membership program. So we need your help. We need the ideas to select the deserving candidate. So last time we did it randomly. This time we are planning to maybe not do it randomly or maybe do it or we were thinking to do a quiz or Q&A or any other way that you suggest would be the best for everyone. Please post it into the comment section and give us new ideas of how we can do the giveaways this time. So moving ahead to the next topic, which is research paper on bug bounties. Yes. So we have been contacted by two professors from the Northeastern University, as you can see, and they were doing a research paper on bug bounty. So we gave an interview to them and yes, it was a pretty awesome. We loved to share our experience in bug bounties. So it was a session of two hours in which we discussed about what is the current space that is going on into bug bounties in India and a lot of our personal experience as well. So this is very great opportunity for you guys as well. They have asked us to recommend someone for the bug bounty interview. So the transcript can be written into the next research paper. So we have been looking someone so that we can recommend him or her in case you are interested in giving the interview and that should be added into the research paper. You are absolutely welcome. For that, you can get in touch with us. So what you can do is you can simply mail your profile to shifa at the rate hactify.in or rohit at the rate hactify.in in which you can simply write a short profile about you, what you have done into bug bounties till now. And uh, yeah, so basically a short description or a short profile of your achievements so that we can refer you to them and basically they can talk and take the follow up interview include it into the next research paper. So very soon guys, when the research paper is out, we are going to publish it again on YouTube. So every one of you can also read the bug bounty research paper as well. All right, so this is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. I will be waiting for your interaction into the comment section 
in case you have any doubts you can always ask it into the comment section and i would be happy to answer all your questions also you can give any quick ideas for our upcoming videos so we can create and plan videos onto that till then stay safe take care